Welcome to ReneeEnergy.com on YouTube, the hub for all things renewable energy and sustainability. Our channel is dedicated to bringing you the latest innovations and insights in green energy, including cutting-edge developments like green hydrogen. Whether you're a sustainability veteran or just beginning your journey, we have something for everyone. Today, we're exploring exciting new projects that are paving the way for a sustainable future. And don't forget, for more in-depth information and resources, visit our website and subscribe to our newsletter for the latest updates and exclusive content. Welcome to an exploration of SAN Battery Technology, a groundbreaking innovation in renewable energy storage. SAN batteries, high-temperature thermal energy storage systems, use sand or similar materials to store excess energy from wind and solar sources as heat. This technology not only offers a solution to the intermittent nature of renewable energy sources but also plays a crucial role in upscaling renewable energy production. The world's first commercial sand battery, located in Konkanpa, Western Finland, exemplifies this technology's potential, heating residential and commercial buildings, including a municipal swimming pool, through a district heating network operated by Vitajankoski. The Technology Behind Sand Batteries a sand battery is essentially an insulated silo made of steel, filled with sand and heat transfer pipes, and accompanied by external equipment like automation components, valves, a fan, and a heat exchanger or steam generator. These batteries are charged using electricity from the grid or local production, typically from fluctuating sources like wind and solar. The electrical energy heats the sand via a closed-loop air pipe arrangement, where air is warmed using electrical resistors and circulated through the heat transfer piping. This system efficiently stores surplus energy, ensuring its availability when needed. Capacity and Temperature The maximum temperature in sand battery systems like the one in Konkanta can reach about 600 degrees Celsius, though it can be higher depending on specific needs. The sand's maximum temperature is determined not by the sand itself but by the heat resistance of the construction and control materials used in the storage system. Unloading and Utilization of Stored Heat Unloading stored heat from sand batteries involves blowing cool air through the pipes, which heats up as it passes through the storage. This heated air can be used to convert water into process steam or heat district heating water in an air-to-water heat exchanger. This method effectively utilizes the stored heat for various applications, demonstrating the system's versatility and practicality in real-world scenarios. Benefits and Applications Sand batteries offer several advantages, making them an attractive solution for thermal energy storage. They are low cost compared to other energy storage technologies, have a long lifespan, and are highly scalable. These features allow sand batteries to store large amounts of thermal energy, accommodating the fluctuating energy production from renewable sources and ensuring a steady supply of energy. However, they do have some limitations, such as lower efficiency compared to alternative technologies and gradual heat loss over time, which requires periodic recharging for optimal performance. Heat retention and efficiency. In terms of heat retention, sand batteries can keep the sand hot for months, although the typical use case, like in Konkanpa, involves charging cycles of about two weeks. These systems are most efficient when charged and discharged 20 to 200 times per year, depending on the application. While primarily storing heat, the energy can be converted back to electricity using turbines like the ORC turbine or a steam turbine, although this involves additional investments and inherent losses. To conclude, sand batteries represent a significant advancement in renewable energy storage, providing a sustainable and efficient solution for managing surplus energy from renewable sources. Their ability to store heat for extended periods and their versatile applications in various sectors, including district heating, industrial processes, and power generation, highlight their potential in contributing to a greener and more sustainable energy infrastructure. Thanks for tuning into the ReneeEnergy.com YouTube channel. We trust you found this episode enlightening and motivating. There's a world of innovation and opportunity in sustainable energy, and we're delighted to share this journey with you. Stay in the loop with the latest on renewable energy and sustainability by visiting our website and subscribing to our newsletter. Your support is immensely appreciated, it's truly invaluable to us. Don't miss our next video on new trends in renewable energy. Follow us on social media for the latest updates. Enjoy the video? Like, subscribe, and share for more green insights. Thanks for watching.